Thank you, Mr. Deputy Speaker. Completing the single market in services means two very different things. Most people would understand it to mean free trade in services. If you can sell a product in one member state, it should be equally available in other member states. In other words, mutual product recognition such as we have for traded goods. But of course that isn't what's contained in this report. What's contained here is an idea for a common regulatory structure where instead of simply enabling more free circulation of services, we are laying down rules on consumer protection and so on that must be evenly applied across all member states. We thereby raise barriers to entry and we create a more regulated, more restricted and tighter market than we would otherwise have. This has been the fundamental flaw in the European market model right from the beginning. Instead of extending consumer choice, we restrict it for the sake of vested interests and established producers. In Britain, we want a common market. We don't want a common regulatory structure and that's why I hope my countrymen will vote to leave.